Hello everybody, it's Looney Clooney here, and I'm back at it again with another Tooth and Tail guide. Today we're going to be talking about one of my favorite tier 1 units to try and use, but really suck at using, and that is the Morning Light Croakers, otherwise known as the Toads. Toads are basically the banelings of Tooth or Tail, you know, and if you don't know what a baneling is, go watch StarCraft, you'll know exactly. But it's a suicide bombing unit that is effectively meant to kill early game units. That's its main goal. It does 12 damage, which will kill any ground unit besides moles, you know, that are tier 1s. Um, and it's very good at just clearing out enemies because it blows up in a um, 3x3 area. So any unit in that area will get damaged. So because of that, you want to actually lead them into the middle of a group rather than just letting them hit, you know, maybe one guy on the side and then, you know, like most of them die trying to get to that one guy. You know, aim for the middle of a cluster of enemies rather than the sides. But this comes into another part of the Morning Light Croakers, which is its biggest weakness. It's really fucking slow. <laughs> Morning Light Croakers are one of the slowest units in the game, and as such, they they move in, and they're really susceptible to any ranged attacks. So because of that, you have to kind of make sure that they have units that can kind of cover them while they go in and blow up, which is why they don't make the best Tier 1 units, you know, in the game. Because, like, yeah, you can run an army with them and have them be the main, you know, bread and butter of the army, However, over time, they're going to get hard countered by everything in the game. Because, you know, ranged units just take them out and shred them. So unless you basically are, like, making huge waves of these guys, they're not really going to be doing, you know, work for you. And also, they're hard countered by air units. So if your enemy's running winged demons, guess what? You're screwed. Some examples of units that can actually defend against toads, though, are honestly squirrels. They're really good at, you know, taking them out because they have a lot of range and they can kite a lot of the, you know, toads before they can even hit them. Um, lizards don't really have any way of dealing with toads, and that's where, like, yes, toads are probably the best ones to have. However, um, yeah, just again just try and kite but overall you know lizards are kind of gonna get damaged by them however if you can build a tier two that does range damage that's really good um falcons being airborne units can basically shoot down the toads and not deal with them because guess what toads can't hit air units kind of sucks doesn't it um snakes can poison the toads and run away so there's that and they're really weak by the way they only have seven hp if i'm correct so there's that. Fucking, they get wrecked easily. Um, and most tier 3 units can deal with them pretty well too, because most tier 3 units do enough damage to really just shred them. Uncle Butter is a really good example of this. Honestly, Uncle Butter is like my main bread and bread and butter. Wow, way to go, Clooney. Make a fucking joke. Anyway, Uncle Butter is my main bread and butter for dealing with all tier 3 un or tier 3 tier 1 units. Um so yeah, there's that. Also, you can use barbed wire, which is like one of the few things that I never hear anyone say to use. Um barbed wire is fucking tits against these guys. Honestly, if you if somebody is using toads obsessively, um, the next game you play with them, just pick barbed wire and start laying it out because barbed wire is really good for defending against toads because they can't get through it without dying. That being said, if they have a whole wave of toads coming in, it's very likely that your line of barbed wire will die after like probably like a good half of the toads get through. So just keep that in mind. But overall, toads, like they're not the best unit in the game. A lot of people I hear are just like, Oh, toads are broken. But no, they, they really aren't. They're just the case of know when to play them, know when to send them in, and have decent, you know, coverage for them to, you know, kill the enemy units, you know, so that way they can actually get in there and, you know, blow up. Or you can defend against them and be like, hey, you know, have any ranged unit just sit there and shoot them. 
Like, fucking... Come on, guys. That's all you need to do. But yeah, this has been Looney Clooney with a unit guide on Tooth and Tail. If you liked this video, should a like and comment below. It really means a lot to me. Come check out the Discord. We love having people come in and, you know, talk with us. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.